So today I'm talking about a Ford with the P0453 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a Ford P0453 code? Well, it's an evaporative emission control system pressure sensor high input. And what does this mean? Well, modern vehicles have what's called an EVAP system that basically takes all the gas vapors from the gas tank and feeds them back into the engine to get burnt off so they don't escape into the atmosphere. And the onboard computer is seeing the pressure's too high inside of the system, so it's gonna have to be troubleshooting a why. And some possible causes, well, it could be the fuel tank pressure sensor, could be in the wiring, could be the vent valve, could be the charcoal canister, and possibly the purge valve. And so the basics of what's going on in the EVAP system is you're gonna have a hose that's gonna leave the gas tank, it's gonna go over to what's called the EVAP charcoal canister, and this basically stores the gas vapors when the engine's not running and things like this. And somewhere near the EVAP charcoal canister is gonna be what's called a vent valve solenoid. And the onboard computer uses this for different things, like to test the system and things like this. And there's gonna be a hose that goes up to the top of the engine, and up here is gonna be called a vapor purge valve solenoid. And basically this purge valve up here just opens when the engine's running, so the gas vapor's going to get burnt off. And then it closes when the engine's not running, so they don't escape. And so the first thing to go and check is gonna be this vent valve solenoid. This can be located on the charcoal canister or it can be separate. It's really gonna depend on the year of the Ford and the type and things like this. But quite often it's located inside of the charcoal canister which will be located up by the gas tank somewhere. There's different ways you go about testing that vent valve. If you have a good OBD2 scan tool, quite often there's an option in there that allow you to enable it. And then when you enable it, you can hear it click and things like this. There's some good YouTube videos on how you go about testing the vent valve. But the first thing to go and do is to check out and be sure that that vent valve is working because if that vent valve is stuck closed then the pressure will build up in the system and it can cause this problem. The next thing that could cause this problem is that this fuel tank pressure sensor has just gone bad. And so there's nothing wrong inside the system, but that fuel tank pressure sensor Sensor has a malfunction, so it's just reporting bad data back to the onboard computer. This includes the wiring going to the fuel tank pressure sensor. The location of the fuel tank pressure sensor can vary a little bit. Well, for example, here's a 2001 Ford Explorer, and it's located up on top of the gas tank, right by the fuel pump. Here's another example of a 2011 F350, and the fuel tank pressure sensor is located on the fuel line. But the next thing to check is if that fuel tank pressure sensor has failed and gone bad. And keep in mind that any wiring going to it, open, short, bad connection, is going to cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So definitely keep that in mind. Another thing that might cause this problem, although not too common, and usually you'll get other error codes if it has gone bad, but the purge valve solenoid that's located on top of the engine might be causing an issue. Usually when a purge valve goes bad, it's gonna give you other error codes. So if you are getting other error codes, be sure to pay attention to that. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a Ford with the P0453 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.